What you doing? I want to like stand up in the camera like this. Yeah. Then you like take a picture of the sunset. You want to do a time lapse? Yeah, time lapse. Let's do it. What are we doing? What are we doing right now? Yeah, uh, cook the heart. We're gonna cook the heart. We've been have we've been brining it in kind of salt and sugar. Ew. Ew. So now yep. we're going to uh, try cooking it up for Huck. Ew. This is the heart from my buck I shot Sunday. Ew. Ew. So you see all these? These are all the internals of the heart. You just gotta cut all that out of there. Oh wow. Hey, it looks much more different and not redder. Yeah, it's not red. Well, because uh, of this, water sucked it all out. Yep, you want to get all the blood and stuff out of it yeah. inside the heart. See, it's all clean now, and all you do is you start to wow, that's, cut it in strips. That, that's cool. Hey, can I dump this out into this water? Uh, let me, let me do it because it's kind of big. I can do it. Okay, you can do it for me. Try it. I'm strong. Good job. So now we got our pan hot. Just cut it up into strips about that big, about quarter inch strips. And now we're going to take one of our hearts and then we're going to lay it in like that. Whoop. Same with this one. Kind of do, don't they? See how it's nice and done like that? Flip it back over. Let it, let it uh, cook on that side, then. Okay. You gonna help me? Ah, you can't have that. I just want to it. No. Where are you off to? Taste test it for Huff before I, uh, before I give you a piece. Man, it seems tender. Wow, that's good. Huff, come here. You gotta taste your heart now. Pretty good? You like it? Yeah. You want some more? Okay. Here's your heart, buddy. You like it? Mm-hmm. Good deal. Deer hearts are a really good cut of meat, but it is an acquired taste or different taste. It uh the texture is much different. It's like a uh, rubber is the wrong word for it. It's like good rubber that's tender, but that's a horrible description. It's not, it's good. When you do a daily vlog, you kind of work a lot. And some chores get behind. I'm just now getting around to taking the cots down from the guys. I were here two weeks ago hunting. something and then this happens so then 
productivity goes down pretty shallow. False alarm. Probably just some stuff she needs. Hi. Hey. I like to stay. Taking a nap or something? Ah. <laughs> nope. I'm just got home. I know. I heard her. I saw her. Good news. What? Mom's home for three months now. Yeah, maternity leave finally. <laughs> Did a member's garage sale today. It's where I like have all my some of my hunting stuff I need to get rid of and just get rid of it to the members for super cheap. And I uh, gotta go ship that stuff now. So the membership is just uh, it's no obligation. And to be honest, like you don't get a lot of extra content out of it. Just a way to kind of support the support me in the channel and. I throw in things like that sometimes. I also do like a random uh, live stream over there and uh, some other random videos. It's in the description if you want to check it out. It's my neighbor Mike. If you think I work hard, that guy, he never stops, man. He, he's motivational to me. I get, my, I get a lot of my work ethic from Mike, <laughs> watching him work all the time out in his uh, garden and his uh, lawn mowing business. Just getting things set up to grind some burger. Meat grinds up better if it's nice and cold, so that's why that's been in the free fridge overnight. So, these grinders have an attachment to where you can fill these bags, but I don't have one, so we're using the meat, uh, the sausage stuffer for this. But as soon as I'm done with this, I'm getting on the internet and order one because this is inconvenient. Taste it. Perfect. All right. Got that many plus the handful Maddie already took to the freezer. So we like these little things. We This is like our second year using these and they're pretty convenient. They're easy to um, you know throw in some water and defrost and pretty easy to uh, pretty clean to work with. The only thing is you got to buy one of these things. I guess you don't have to, but these things make it real nice. Breakfast for dinner tonight. Huck's watching my favorite show as a kid. Power Rangers. Right, bud? course see this how doesn't have a label on it scrambles homemade jelly that'll make you want to kick a fat kid in target you know You are in it. 
but you're like all in it. Scoot over. Let me yeah. show you it, but come here back here. 